And the racing gets underway here in Fajera. It's a very good start by the looks of it from T-Bone Station. And oh, Faza, Faza have, are on fire at the back. That's incredible. The race leading boat is out of the race. The defending champions, they've had an engine let go. And there is Videx, Videx out. Rahib are out of the race as well, unfortunately. Moad suffering. The left rear engine is gone by the looks of things, and from third place, they are going to be the next boat that retires from this incredible Fajera Grand Prix. The left-hand engine's gone on the race leader's T-Bone station, so another race leader retires here in Fajera. What an action-packed race this has turned into. It's victory for Abu Dhabi team in the opening round of the season in Fajera. There's the green flag. So the race gets underway once again here in Dubai as we see the three leaders coming through. And it is T-Bone Station who've got a great start again. Will they be able to hold on to the advantage? There's a side by side here actually. And this is between Videx and Horsenboos. That's for position. This is boat number three, X Dubai, trying to get past Lady Spain. Lady Spain have gone in very, very deep into the final corner. Our top two are doing their long lap, yes. Both of them on the same lap. So now it's all going to be about where they come out. But here we go. It's going to be right neck and neck. And I think T-Bone Station are going to hold the lead of the race. And now they're going to be challenged because Abu Dhabi team are coming at them with greater speed. So T-Bone Station are in the lead. These are the three leading boats. T-Bone Station still fractionally have the lead at the time being. But Dubai have got the greater speed as they head down the back straight side by side for the lead of the race. What a race this is turning into here in Dubai and what a season it's turning into. There go X Dubai, through on the inside of the final turn. Abu Dhabi team are coming up alongside, around the outside of T-Bone Station and into second place. X Dubai have fought back and Arif al Zafin and Nadia Bin Hendi are going to win for the first time this season in the second round of the championship here in Dubai. Sasana holds up the green flag and the race gets underway here in Qashqais. Boat 3 X Dubai starting on the pole position. You can see the 28 boat there on the left-hand side of shot. They've had a bit of a jump start. Global Marine, Alfredo Amato and uh, Roberto Lopiano really pulling away. And Marco Panetti having a good run out there. But meanwhile, the race leaders X Dubai are looping back around once more. Oh, goodness me. Big moment for Rashid Altar and Balak Mansouri. Whoa, Abu Dhabi team going for it again. They are really struggling in these conditions to keep the nose down. Down towards turn one again, the battle for third place, the final spot on the podium, and they're going absolutely side by side into the next right-hander. They're almost going to touch as they come towards turn one. And that's the second place boat out of the race. T-Bone Station, Giovanni Carpatella and Marco Panetti look to be out for the third race in a row. They've retired from second position. On the final lap of this race, here come our race leaders, X Dubai. The checkered flag is waiting and it falls in Portugal for X Dubai. X Dubai, I don't want to call it. It's going to be X Dubai by about a boat length over Dubai. Oh, oh, oh it's a Dubai boat over. Goodness. Dubai's gone over! Oh, it's been a... On the line, a okay. big crash for Dubai! It's go, go, go for the first time down under. And from pole position, X Dubai lead the field across the Pacific Ocean. So Global Marine gets past easily, but now the Sweetcat has another go. There's Global Marine. Look how close they get! Oh, that's some unbelievable stuff by Eric Stark. And Michael Bankston. Oh, Dubai, Dubai's inverted for the second time in two days. Dubai is upside down. This is unbelievable stuff here. Full course, red flag. The race is stopped.
That's Salam Maladidi removing his harness, throws it onto the hull. Cannot believe what has happened twice in one weekend. Oh, and take a look at this. Unbelievable bad luck for the T-Bone Station. Getting ready to restart now. There's the green flag from Pasquale Zazana. Go, go, go. He yells absolutely flat out. Nose up in the air. Airborne as they head towards the checkered flag for their third XCAT World Series victory of the 2015 season. This is round four, the first time in Australia. Well done to RFL Savane and the dear Ben Hendy who take the win. And the race gets underway. Round five of the UIMX Cat World Series begins. But look at the air that they're getting. This is so spectacular. Abu Dhabi team into the lead of the race. And these are the two boats that are battling at the top of the championship. Yachts are out of the race. And that is a, a real shame for them. Oh, and there, boat number three. X Dubai have broken down. Araf Al Zafin no. and Nadir Bin Hendi. The championship leaders look to be out of the race just after they've taken the lead. Oh, moment. And here is Boat 22, Videx, and they are now in the lead of the race. They're up the inside, and Boat 6, Nicolini, are into the lead of the race, coming up towards the far end of the course, and as it stands, into the lead of the championship as well. Oh, oh my word, it's a submarine. Whoa. That wow. is Boat 6, six it's Marcel Polly and Matteo no Nicolini, they no dive. The chequered flag is being waved, and Boat 22, Joachim Kumlin and Alfredo Armato win the fifth round of the UIM XCAT World Series. I can see them out of the window punching the air in the cockpit. Start has been made by Boat 5 Abu Dhabi, but they're going absolutely side by side with X Dubai, and it's X Dubai who have the advantage at the moment. Oh, and uh, the six boat are coming across the line now, have got problems there on the right hand side. They've only got one engine, I think, through the final turn of the 2015 UIM XCAT World Series season comes boat number three, X Dubai. Araf Al Zafin and Nadir Bin Hendi see the checker flag, win the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix, and win the 2015 championship. There are our 2015 champions, Arif Al-Zafin and Nadir Bin Hendi.